Hello everyone, welcome to question number 2 on advanced question series on parabola. So today's question is, let a variable called at t1 and t2, that is parametric form is given, of parabola y square is equal to 4x, subtends a right angle at a fixed point on the curve, that is t0 of the curve. Show that it passes through a fixed point, we have to show, and also find the coordinates of that fixed point. Now, if they have given this information as, let's say, the chord, which is subtending the right angle instead of given the fixed point t naught if they have given it is subtending at vertex so i think all of us remember the result and you should remember the result if you don't remember that fixed chord will pass through 4a comma 0 if it's going to subtend a 90 degree at origin or vertex you can say in this case now there are two methods from which you can do method one is i think you can homogenize method two i'm going to show you that's why i've taken this question there is one more method which is very quick so let's start with the parabola y square is equal to 4x. So this is our parabola. So let me draw a second. Let's say we have two points on the parabola and let's call this point as R point. That is a t1 square comma 2a t1 is the parametric coordinate. And let's say this point is q here. That is a t2 square comma 2a t2 now let's say this chord rq is subtending a 90 degree let's point let's call this p point as p here that is t naught point they have given that is a t naught square comma 2a t naught now this is subtending a 90 degree at this fixed point instead of giving vertex now they are saying all the chords which is subtending the 90 degree at p point are passing through a fixed point then that means we can do it from family of straight line it's kind of getting feel from a fixed point okay now let's let me start with the slopes okay so if i want to calculate the slope of p let's say pr if i want to calculate so i think i can calculate y2 minus y1 upon x2 minus x1 so i think we'll get this as two times a we'll get this here t1 minus t0 whole divided by i can say this this will be equal to t1 square minus t0 square and a i'm going to take common so m of pr i think m of pr into m of pq here that will be equal to minus 1 because these two are 90 degree to each other and from here m of pr will be equal to i think t1 minus t0 and t1 minus t0 will cancel out here a and a will cancel out if you factorize this you will get this as 2 upon you can write this as t0 plus t1 immediately so this will, the slope is m of pr is 2 upon t0 plus t1 here Similarly, m of pq, if you calculate, it will be exactly same. Only thing is, instead of t1, you have to replace t2. So, it will get t0 plus t2 here. That is equal to minus 1. Let me raise this part. Now, next thing is, I'm going to do here, that is, uh, I'm going to simplify this. This will give me a good expression, that is, minus 4, I can write, that will be equal to, here you will get t0 square plus, you will get here t1 plus t2 multiplied by t0 plus t1 t2 here now i'm going to do one more thing that is i'm going to calculate the equation of chord equation of chord that is our chord is rq here so in general i remember the equation of the chord joining t1 and t2 like this that is y is equal to x upon am arithmetic mean of t1 t2 and a times gm square upon am now I'll show you what I mean by like writing like this. So y is equal to, I can write this as x upon arithmetic mean of t1, t2 is t1 plus t2 divided by 2 plus a times t1, t2 geometric mean will be root over t1, t2 square of that will be t1 and t2. Whole thing divided by t1 plus t2 divided by 2. Now what I'm going to do is this fixed line they are saying this com this fixed line that is the common chord which is passing through a fixed point. So in general, I can write this line as, uh, if I take t1, t2 common, I can write this as t1 plus t2 multiplied by y is equal to, I can write this as 2x plus 2a t1 t2. I can immediately write. Now here, t0 is a fixed thing here. So I'm going to do one thing. I'm going to convert the whole thing in the terms of t0 here. So I'm going to immediately replace the value of t1, t2 here in this equation. And we'll get a line something like this l1 plus lambda l2 immediately you'll get this line i'll show you in the next slide if we get this line this represents family of line passing through l1 is equal to 0 and l2 is equal to 0. 
Now I'm going to substitute the value of T1, T2 in the equation of the chord. So we'll get this as T1 plus T2 into Y is equal to 2X minus 2A times. I can write this as 4 times plus T0 square plus T0 multiplied by T1 plus T2. Now I'm going to do one thing. I'm going to calculate the coefficient of T1 plus T2. So I'm going to take everything on the left hand side. So if I take everything on the left hand side, I think we'll get this as uh, T1 plus T2 multiplied by Y. And then uh, if I take T1 plus T2 common here, I think we'll end up getting this as plus 2A T0 here. And on the other side, we'll get this as plus times. Uh, rest of the component, if I write here, the rest of the terms are this term, this term and this term. So if I write this as, you will get this as minus 2x and then plus, uh, you can write 8a and then a minus or you can say plus 2a t naught square. You will get this. Now as you can see, this will be in the form of L1 or you can say L1. You can call this as L1. L1 plus lambda L2 and L1 plus lambda L2 always represents family of straight lines which is always passed through L1 is equal to 0 and L2 is equal to 0. So if I take L1 is equal to 0 then I think I'll get this x as 4a plus you can say plus uh, you can say if you divide by 2 you'll get this as a t naught square. So this is the x coordinate and if you remember the result for the vertex, it is 4a. For the other point, it is 4a plus a t naught square. Now the value of y will be is equal to minus 2a t naught. This is the fixed point. So let me write the fixed point. The fixed point is from which it's going to pass. That is 4a plus a t naught square comma minus 2a t naught. So hence proved the line is passing through the fixed point, this point, And we have calculated the point as well as. And that will be all.